this year in 14 touchdowns. Pitches right side. Hartwig is into the end zone. Touchdown, Maples! Six nothing, Seaholm on the Hartwig scamper. And the offense hasn't slowed down from a week ago, Stick. No, and just when you focus on Colton Kinney, what happens? Hartwig comes around on this swing screen or what do you pitch pitch sweep for a touchdown. But that's the thing with this Veer offense, it's not just a dive left, it's not just a dive right, you know, fake up the middle trap. It's they attack you on every single possible angle. Hartwig's fourth rushing touchdown of the year. The extra point is up, and it is good. Droll passing game, 70% of the offense is through the air. Osborne has accounted for 50 touchdowns this year. That's right, 50. 29 passing touchdowns, 21 rushing touchdowns. Slant route here caught. Watch out. Open field, he could go. This is Aiden Bow down the right sideline, and this game is about to be tied. That's the ever dangerous Aiden Bow getting loose, and it's a 66 yard touchdown pass. And we're tied it up just like that. <laughs> Strap it up, buddy. Buckle up, we're going for a long haul. Yeah, and I was just saying, sitting over there, you know, you kind of get weary. Nope, sorry. <laughs> Not for Mr. Osborne. He comes out firing, and then, of course, number three takes it to the house, and great blocking downfield by his wide receiver crew. 61 yard touchdown pass and catch. And Bo is into the end zone. Here comes the extra point. Attempt and it is good. Somehow snuck through that left upright. That's Benitez, the junior kicker in this game. Second and seven. Osborne gonna run it right side has the sticks first down has the end zone touchdown Corsairs 13 yard touchdown run Caleb Osborne he now has a passing touchdown and he has his 22nd rushing touchdown of the year Mott takes their first lead yeah, and it's almost too easy for Water Vermont on that you have man coverage so as soon as the wide receivers start heading down the field the coverage goes with them Osborne sees them all running away from him and says, you know what, I got the foot speed to beat everybody on this field. And he does. We saw him doing a sideline foot drill, and he was just absolutely destroying what he was supposed to be doing. It was, it was really fun to watch. Silky smooth. Chris Barr likes his humility. Benitez extra point is up, and it is good. At least showing it. Osborne to the gun. Look it, pulls it down, runs to the one, shut down, stopped on downs. The Maples hold, the M -M 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 Maples hold. A stand at the one, Osborne stopped, and Seaholm gets a huge stand with 1.11 left in this half. Looks like even if they would have scored, it was an illegal shift. But here you get a look at the play, and a great defensive play by Seaholm. And that's what I was talking about. When you're down here at the goal line, all the defenders can face the line of scrimmage. Trips to the left. Caleb keeps left side, corner, end zone, touchdown, Corsair. Caleb's second rushing job of the night and Mott's up by a couple. It's almost like having a cheat code. You know, if you if you were playing Madden and you had to create a player, he's the quarterback you want to create. Look at the speed getting to the outside. Great blocking down the field by Donovan Isaac once again, able to give his quarterback the angle to get in, but he just glides with that football in his hands. 94 yards on the ground for Caleb Osborne. It's his second rushing touchdown. <clears throat> is 23rd of the year. Extra point, Benitez up, and it is good. Somehow, they've had a couple do what they needed to get back on track and try to cut it to a one-score game. Kinney, pitches, right side, fantastic catch by Emerson! Touchdown, Maples! Oh, 
what a snatch by Everson. And the place is electric right now. Yeah, Emerson making another great play on a pitch. That's twice tonight we've seen the running backs kind of bail out the pitch man. But look at that one-handed grab with the cutback. It kind of led him into that cutback, which put the cornerback out of position. So it worked out for him in a huge response for Seaholm here at home. Extra point by Billings is up, and it is good. So, Chad Stick, send it back to you. Thank you, Kara. Curl route, Geno Seats caught. Watch out, he can go. Midfield, Geno Seats, and they'll never get him. He's going to go 79 yards for a touchdown. And Mott strikes quick in another two play touchdown drive. Yeah, two is the magic number for Waterford Mott tonight. That's their third touchdown drive on two plays. And you just see. Gino Seats makes one man miss, and like you said, you're never gonna catch that man. And he's looking to be the quarterback eventually at this program when they when they move on. And you can tell they're gonna have some athleticism at that position for years to come. A lot of speed, size, and skill for this Mott team, and that's a quick gouge and answer. Here comes the extra point attempt by Sinan Benitez, looking to convert on his fourth PAT, and it is good. Well, he's had three out of the four barely make it, but close only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. See home down two touchdowns. Colton Kinney, three-year starter at quarterback, hand off right side to his brother, and the twin is in! Touchdown, Maple! What a great run by Kinney, but we gotta hand it to the offensive line on this. It was a massive hole blown open right in the middle, 75-51, all getting into the action, and a nice touchdown. Keeping it a one-score game. Brandstorm, Thurswell, Johnson, Baldner, Ernie, they're, they're all doing their thing down there. Sure are. Sullivan to hold it. Baldner to snap it. And Billings extra point is good. So at one. Osborne keeps it right side. And he is close. This one's too close to call. Seaholm celebrating. It looks like they're spotting it right on the five yard line and giving them the first down. First down indeed, Osborne comes up gimpy. Caleb Osborne will hobble off the field and he's in some pain. Here's another look stick. See where he came down. He came down well past the five yard line. So yeah, that's yeah. clearly a first down even though they marked the ball a little bit short. Geno Seats, that's where he will be next year. This is a comfortable spot for him. Hand off, up the middle, touchdown Mott. Touchdown by Barnes, and with two minutes left, the Corsairs are up two score. <laughs> and the student section for Mott is going crazy. But yeah, just good blocking up front right there by the big nasties for Mott. We gave the credit to the Seaholm line, but the Mott line doing their thing too. And there you see Barnes just putting it over the end zone. 